This is the Bulldog 3D. I'm Darren. Today we're going to look at how we change the filament on a Bandle Lab P1S or P1P. I have some new filament here. So we're going to change over for what's currently printing. So let's get started. From this main menu, currently the top icon is highlighted. And so we come down to the next icon, which looks like a print head. Uh, then we come across one and then come all the way down to feeding. Send to feeding and then hit OK. And now on this screen, there's load, unload and retry. Uh, right now I have filament, purple filament in there. So we're gonna come down to unload, hit OK. Print is gonna start warming up. Print is going to start heating the printhead. Uh, you can see over here that it's heating up. It's going to get to about 250 degrees Celsius. It'll let you know to unload the current filament. Just tell you to really cut the filament, and that's saying to pull back on the filament that's already loaded. So let me turn this slightly. We can just start pulling back on this filament. wind the spool as we go. Now what we're going to look for is a place to put the end so that everything doesn't get tangled up. So grab our new filament here, we'll find the end. There and I'm probably going to, I'm going to just going to do a quick 45 degree cut on there. I typically start feeding a small amount of the filament through. You will see it come through the top. I'm not going to go all the way in. We'll come back to the main screen. Go one up and hit load. So the print is going to heat the nozzle again. So once it's at temperature, it's going to take to continue loading the, the rest of the filament. What we're going to do, feed gently filament through here. Keep feeding. You feel it have a little bit of resistance, and that's when you stop. From there, we can hit done. You'll be able to feel filament being pulled through the back. We can hit load again. So again, you'll just feel a little bit of filament coming through. You don't need to push it. Once everything's complete, you can flick it, hit OK, but done. Back to the main menu, we go to the left, to the left again, go up one, and now we're ready to print. And there we are changing the filament on a bamboo lab P1S or P1P. If you're enjoying any of my videos, please consider liking and subscribing and share some comments below. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.